Hey guys, welcome to today's MCAT question of the day. As always, we'll be working our way through one of the many MCAT practice problems found at MCATSelfPrep.com, the home of the free MCAT prep course. I'm Andrew George, a 99th percentile MCAT tutor, and I'll be walking you through today's practice problem as if you're one of my private tutoring students. Be sure to hit pause and try this practice problem for yourself before watching my explanation. In answering this question, Let's think about the central dogma of molecular biology. It states that DNA becomes RNA, which becomes protein. And let's imagine that there is a mutation on this DNA. That mutation will get transcribed into the RNA, which will then be transcribed into the protein. This is a serious issue because DNA is going to be used over and over and over again. It lasts basically forever. So every RNA that gets created based on this DNA template from here on out is going to be mutated like this. That means every single protein that this gene creates is going to be mutated. This is a serious issue. Whereas, let's imagine that instead the mutation occurs in the level of RNA on this single RNA strand. This one RNA, you know, it might get translated maybe, I don't know, maybe a hundred times during its lifetime because its lifetime is very short. So maybe a hundred of these proteins will be mutated, but compared to the thousands upon thousands upon thousands of proteins that are going to be generated, that's a very, very small amount. And not only that, but this is a very temporary problem because, you know, RNA, you know, it doesn't last super long anyways, so this one will probably degrade fairly soon, meaning this problem will probably end really quickly. And you probably won't even notice any issues at all. And the last scenario here, would be if the mutation was on the level of protein. And as you can imagine, if only a single protein is mutated, not a big issue, especially because proteins, you know, they only last a few days or so, depending on the protein. So not a huge deal with this one. Let's take a second look at the question stem. Mutations are only a serious issue if they occur, occur on the level of DNA. That's the correct answer here. Because DNA is permanent, and every single mRNA and protein that's produced thereafter from that DNA is going to be messed up, and that's a serious problem. If you liked this MCAT question of the day, be sure to give it a like. And for more MCAT questions of the day, be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel and enroll in our free MCAT prep course found at MCATSelfPrep.com. And if you are really looking to maximize your MCAT score, feel free to visit my tutoring profile page and request a free 10-minute phone consultation. I would love to chat with you about your situation and how you can maximize your MCAT score. I look forward to hearing from you soon. We'll see you next time.